first step right, here is adjusting our attitude. We're in a cruise attitude, pushing max power. To stay level at our target altitude, let's start by easing the throttle back to 1800 RPMs. 18? You probably noticed, to maintain altitude, you need to pitch the nose up. You could just keep pulling on the yoke to hold steady, but that's not really a precise means of control. Probably better to adjust your trim wheel until you don't need to push or pull on the yoke. Drag the trim down when you need to set the nose up. Drag it up to set the nose down. Try adding trim to keep us at 5,500 feet without increasing throttle. If you feel our pitch slipping and need to get back to the proper what? attitude, don't worry. Just pull on the yoke yeah. and dial in the right trim. What is or eight at fifty five? Oh no, we need to climb back up then. I don't know where the trim measurement is. Also, I'm afraid that we're gonna get out of the uh, area, so I'm gonna turn around. get back up to 55 and maintain RPMs at 18 so right there is good yeah huh I don't know I can't hear you what I don't know Literally 45 minutes ago. Yeah. So I need to get back up to 55. All right, we're gonna use some speed here. always bump it back down once we get to the here we go all right 55 and then eight uh, I had it eight the way I was taught when you adjust the trim you make rough changes at first to remove pressure on the yoke then small adjustments to find the perfect setting to keep your desired attitude. That's the key to straight and level flight. It saves you from constantly pushing or pulling on the yoke. And that gives you more time to enjoy the ride. If you want more practice using the trim, go for it. Whenever you're ready to pass the controls, I'll be here. All right, control alt X. Okay, I have control. Get me Hope out you of enjoyed there. the lesson. Yeah, it's okay, lesson. Okay. I'm still kind of confused about the yoke part, but or the trim. But okay. Uh landing. Haha. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's see how uh this one goes here. Wait, which side is that? Oh my god, you can literally see it. Tell me. Um, telling me she was able to have control and she just let you do a flip yes she's technically flying with us the whole time here wow this is what i'm currently using by the way pat this is the extreme 3d pro Look at it. Uh, and it seems to work pretty good too. My first instructor used to say the best part of flying is landing in one piece. The man was a terminal pessimist, but oh he wasn't wrong. 
Today, you're in charge of bringing us in for a safe landing. Yeah, everything is sold out. We've got for a straight-in approach, so we don't have to complete the standard traffic pattern. And I've already set us up in landing configuration. At 65 knots, with 10 degrees of flaps and idle power. We're on the glide slope now. Maintain speed around 65 knots. Change your pitch if you need to, and keep your aim point on the runway number. When you're targeting the runway number, you want to keep it steady in your sights. If it looks like the number's moving Why up in your are we going up so you're high? coming in low. You'll need to add a bit more throttle to get back on the slope. Okay, okay. You if want me to maintain like the 65? If in your windscreen, well, then you're too high. You'll need to add flaps to increase it, your rate oh. of descent, but you'll also need to push forward and trim to change your attitude and maintain the same speed. F8. Yeah, I'm excited for it. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what it is. I'm going to be waiting quite a while until I do any type of upgrades, though. I don't feel like anything, like, the graphics cards will get better, but, like, right now, I don't feel like anything is at the point where it's, like, crazy anyways. Because even with an RTX 2080, like, people still struggle to get, like, 60 frames or higher. Keep your aim point on the runway threshold. 1500. When you're 10 feet above the runway, it's time to flare. Once we pass the threshold, Shift your aim point to the end of the runway. Then, pull back slightly on the yoke to aim the nose just above it. Ouch. It's okay, like... we're past the threshold. Start the flare. Keep pulling back slowly. Let the plane settle onto the runway. Don't push it down, but don't let it start climbing. Ah, this is going to be a rough landing. Oh my god. Oh god. Nice. Now apply the brakes to slow us down and bring the plane to a stop. Okay. Great job. As they say, any landing you can walk away from is a good landing. But if you can use the plane the next day, it's outstanding. Landings can be hard. I feel like Even the entire time pilots, I was like holding me, it to the right side. To After all, while also like for, right? pulling back and pushing forward and pulling back and pushing forward. I'm like, oh God, this is rough. But hey, I mean, yeah, true. We did get it. Technically our first uh, first landing, so not bad, not bad. You're on the line. Thanks, guys. You make me feel better. <laughs> I thought it was like, okay. I mean, it was okay, but thanks, guys. All right, so we got one, two, three, four. Oh, is this a, it's a touch and go. Little baby's crying. Little baby Kiara. Oh wow. It's a lock. Wow. Are you locked you up? Hey, I do have the key. Are you gonna be my co-pilot? Here, come take a seat next to me. <laughs> yeah, right, I'm gonna fly with the dog today, guys. Sisters. It looks big. It looks big. Big mess. Well, I mean, like, it fits it's good. Small. Let's be honest. No one likes going around in circles. Unless you're a pilot training on traffic patterns. True. Sedona's standard traffic pattern follows did a 1,000-foot uh, altitude around Google the main Earth runway. To generate the world? Yes. By the time it we're did, through here, you'll like, know how to complete the full run. From takeoff uh, to landing. It's so like let's get started. Two point three tri bytes. <laughs> Something like that. Take off. Big earth. Yeah, big earth. 
something like that. Oh wait, uh, forgot to remove this. This thing really pulls to the left. Like every time. What does she want me to get to? When we're up, keep us aligned with the runway and climb to 5,400 feet. Okay. We're going for a left hand traffic pattern. I see it. 55. Uh, 55. Okay, climb. Climb, climb, climb. You're going to start turning left 90 degrees toward a 122 degree heading. 90 degrees? Okay, we're in the pattern. Get ready to enter the crosswind section. Good. Keep going till you reach the traffic pattern altitude of 5,700 feet. Ready 57. to make your left turn downwind? When the runway appears at the halfway point of your wing strut, you'll know you're at a good glide distance. How taxing is the game? Uh, I don't think it. Back now. We're on the right track. It's not too bad, but lower uh, your nose to a cruise attitude and reduce power to 2100 RPMs. 21. Okay. Once your speed is in the white arc, add 10 degrees of flaps to prep us for landing. It can be a, a pretty laggy though, um, especially in like populated the areas. Is looking good. And it probably goes without saying. Always watch out for other planes entering or exiting the pattern. We're going to fly past the end of the runway here. Shit. Keep going until you see it at a 45 degree angle behind you. It's not too. I mean, yeah, no, nah, it's your pretty cue bad. To turn left again it can't onto be. the base leg. I mean, like right now it's fine, but uh, if you're on higher settings or even at like the main menu, things like that, it's pretty bad. <laughs> but once you're actually in the air, it seems to be like, okay. What am I on? Um, I am settings. I'm on medium. Right now, I'm on medium. All right. Reduce power to idle to start losing altitude and maintain cruise attitude. Keep an eye on the runway as we get ready for our final turn. That'll also I was keep on our high, speed around but 65 knots. it seems like medium is like the good uh, good setting. I have a 2070 Super. Uh, uh, RTX 2070 Super i7 6700. And medium settings right now. No, I didn't make any there changes or anything. The runway's in full view. Make sure to keep the plane centered on approach. If you're too high, add flaps. Too low, add power to maintain the glide path. Yeah, exactly. Okay. All right, chat, we're going in. Trying our best here. Ah, okay. 
<laughs> a little sketchy, but hey. All right, break, 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 break. Way to stick the landing. Now, just hey. apply the brakes to slow your roll. And make sure you don't stop on the runway, of course. What? If other planes are looking to land, we've got to move. Take one of the taxiways on the right. <laughs> if you want to crash in your house, yes, you can. I was able to fly before I got on here. I was able to fly right or directly over my house, and it's pretty Good detailed. Job. As an old instructor said to me, "Not only did you not die, you're really learning to fly." <laughs> nice, not bad, not bad. I, I don't know if it's the like planes that I'm flying or something, but like literally this thing is pulling to the left so much, so I have to turn it to the right like the rudders to the right so that way it's like not pulling me to the left as much once i finish this training though we'll definitely do like uh our own flight i mean honestly i feel like we might even be able to do one now i guess chat should i continue training or should we do a flight my computer i was getting 30 to 60 frames yeah yeah, I saw L Lyric is even playing it too right now, and he was getting like 20, 20 like frames per second. Yeah, I mean, we got like the basics down, I guess. So I'll, I'll actually do a flight. That's fine. Yeah, they, they definitely need to optimize it. Also, I did see a thing too that was like, like the technology for this game is there, or like, as in the technology, like, for creating the game is there right now for this but the hardware isn't and i would say yeah that's probably just about right like they were able to create this but the hardware to run everything like at full maximum capacity and all that not quite there yet but but still and i'm assuming that this is this is a game that just like flight x yeah, the new crisis. <laughs> but can it run Flight Sim X on Ultra? Huh? Huh? All right, so here's how this works. The only stream I have uh, seen get good FPS is Bike Man. Um, so here it is, y'all. Here's the map. Here's the world. Um, right now it's a little bit laggy too. But yeah, you can see like when you're in this part, it's pretty bad um so the way it also works is these stars everything that you see are like the recommended airports but these little dots if we zoom in close those dots every single little dot that you can see is an airport So, I think what we're going to do is, and look, there's even, like, this is my area around here. In here is my area. That's a pretty vast area. I'm not going to show exactly the one by me, but, like, this area is where I'm from like around wait no that's washington baltimore uh like around here <laughs> i'm not gonna zoom all the way to my house <laughs> but what airport is this harrisburg okay uh this one might be lancaster and i'll zoom all the way to your house <laughs> i want to see my front porch and i'll fly to your house no, 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 no. <laughs> uh, what, what airport is this? Yeah, Heritage Field. I know some of these. Willow Grove. Here's what we can do. This, yeah. Oh my God, yes. This is, I don't think this is bad. 
um but will grow this right here is it's not active right now this is a military base um and it's actually the place that i would i used to go for my uh my unit so this this runway is technically shut down but we'll take off from there and let's fly to doesn't show the right buildings they're all generic looking buildings what do we have how long would it take to some of them some of them show correct i mean like the land uh dev are you still in here or cardinal you guys have a i mean we can fly to austin rival is that what's that time right there cll is that three hours and 47 minutes or like in game time or is it three hours crystal airport cll i don't think you can search like that or i don't know c l l can you yes real time oh no hell no i'm not doing a three hour flight guys sorry <laughs> what how about this set arrival one hour 50 percent sure i mean i'll do like a do austin or do the longest flight i think it's 15 hours how about we fly to hawaii Twelve hours, fifty-five minutes. Perfect. <laughs> Turn on infinite fuel and circumventilate the the globe. Can you actually turn on? Well, I guess that would be this. That's these settings, right? Uh, yeah, that's air. I think we might stick with the one that we currently have. I feel like that's a good endurance, five hours range. A good plane to, to fly with. Crystal Airport to Dula International. Oh, let me see. That's weight and balance. Can you do like infinite fuel and stuff? Oh, it's so laggy. Just even trying to get to these settings right here. Here comes the Wii mod. Nah, I think you can actually do like that kind of settings in here. Because otherwise, you're going to have to land somewhere and full up, fuel up, or go somewhere else. Yeah, in general settings. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, hold on one sec. I'm going to check. I'm trying to get to ATC options. Because that's where your like call sign is and stuff. That is what. It's showing on the Hawaii flight. Oh, that you need to land several times. Uh, uh, I see, I see, I see. Okay, that's why it's like, oh, you have to land here and then land there. Also, I still have it set to Honolulu, so let me uh, change that. If I can get out of this freaking menu. If we ever load out of it, I'll look at uh, KMSP to what is KMSP to KDLH. I I do want to take off from this Willow Grove one. I want to take off from there, but I'll fly really anywhere else in the U.S. Oh my God! Please just let me freaking close the menu. 
please. There we go, Jesus. Oh no. No! No! No, I don't want to quit! Too many times. I clicked it too many times. No. Here we go. Please, game. I'm literally clicking. Okay, come on. Take me into the world map. World map. Come on, we can do it. The hardest part is getting to through the menu. <laughs> Everything else is doable after. <laughs> no. <laughs> Dude, I, this is, look at this. I feel like we're at 95 right now. Or 99. Then the Flight Sim X came out in 99, right? I feel like we're in 99. <laughs> Bro, literally. Please. Game. Please, I just want to fly. What is this? Why does it look like this? How good of a pilot are you? Yeah, it's going on, Kilgan. I'm okay. Your short flight is going to be pretty short, only about 30 minutes in air. I can't even do any of the settings. I'm afraid. Options. Okay, we're good. Right there. Why does it get stuck like this? It's like as if I have them. Oh, there we go. Whatever costs most money. Audio lost. Never mind. That was my fucking browser. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. I was like, oh, no. All right, how about this? Uh, how about Detroit? What about Detroit? That is a rival. It's one hour and ten minutes still. Niagara Falls. All right, I'm down with this. Did you install the new drivers? Yeah, I did. And this is only Navlog. Ascent, descent. Yeah, let's do this. Niagara Falls. Hamilton. Uh, okay, let's hit fly. I'm not even going to bother changing any settings at this point because I'm just like, just let me load. Osh Oshkosh? Oshkosh? Where's that? The game is not even loading. Dude, how? I can't even do anything. Fly, motherfucker. Fly. Take me. I hate we're good. Breathe. Gotta yell at, at it for it to work true. Oh my god, we're loading. Three and a half months later. What we need to do is we need to have like a non, there needs to be like a very basic setting for the main menu 
so that way you can navigate between everything because i feel like it's like loading everything in the background as you're trying to like select the map and every or like the airports and stuff so like because it's trying to do that or it's or it's like uh just loading so much in the background it's just i think it lags it a lot but we should be okay now <laughs> let's say with nasa computers for like what what kind of like graphics cards and like cpus do you think like nasa computers use like are they out here with like a it's like an i9 and like sli uh like rtx 2080 ti's <laughs> yeah that's what i mean like is it even, if it is it just something that they develop themselves or are they like straight up just uh quadro quadro most are intel yeah huh like what what they don't do pick up no. oh I want to do some wait um, oculus said we're announcing some important updates on people logging out oculus devices while keeping their vr profile starting october 2020 everyone using oculus device for the first time will need to log in with a facebook account <laughs> from facebook gaming to oculus fake facebook is doing an incredible job making gamers not want to use their stuff Tower Casas one three three seven ready for departure Casas. to the north at runway one three three seven. Hey. <laughs> Dude, that is so funny. They they actually have the road behind you too. <laughs> behind it. We we usually buy that stuff, that kind of stuff for DOD stuff. Usually a Xeon or higher. Damn. Damn, son. Here, yeah, but I want to get something too. Huh? I know. That's what I need to find something too. Alright, chat. It's go time. Let me put this uh, into checklist. Camera. God. Hold on, let me turn the that off. I see you. Do you see me right now? Oh, I see you. I see you too. <laughs> I see you right there. Hold on. Why can't I? I'm trying to get this stupid. Here we go. External. All right, we're good. Yeah, what's going on, Jay Marie? What? All right, hold on, chat. Before we take off, I need to order something. Do they actually have pictures of it? Hmm. <laughs> we should fly together. We can. We can all fly together. Money stink four twenty. I like that name. <laughs> what are you actually here? I see you. I'm getting sweet and sour chicken. You play air tag. <laughs> uh, let's see. All 
Alright, I'm ready in five seconds. Submitting. Processing. Complete. There we go. Alright, so where's our... How do you see where you're going? Uh, V? Is that it? That's our path right there? Alright, chat. Blown, are you ready? 11. That green cross there, too, I think. Where's that? No, that actually, that's 600. Well, that's, I think that's correct, too. Oh, I think that is, that's it. That's it, too. The 252. All right, let's do it. Take off. Yeah, that, yeah, that is it. All right, Blunder, let's do it. I feel like this is really loud. This thing is quick. Holy crap. Raise landing gear. Uh, <laughs> six. Got it. Holy crap. <laughs> Complete the initial climb to 500 AGL. Compass 1337, you are leaving my airspace frequency change approved. What? Oh, shoot. Wrong button. How do I go back into... Compass 1337, radar contact one mile northwest of Willow Grove, 1,500. How do I get back in the first person? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Uh-oh. Tower on 118 decimal 5 I wasn't ready. Should I get mad at you and freak out that you're not a profile and you shouldn't be allowed to have fun in a game of us who play seriously like everybody else and every, and every other one ever? Wait, what? Profile and so this we shouldn't be allowed to have fun in the game. But you're so high up there already, jeez. True gamer. Points of interest, joystick button one. I think that's one. Uh, I wish there was a camera button on here. Right, let's get, let's go into the cockpit. All right, we're good. Unless you play seriously. Unless... Airspeed above 110. I can't even see it in this one. Uh, this is so much different. Continue to climb to designate cruise altitude. Every plane is so different. Oh my god. What are we at? I think we're going to 84 if I remember correctly. When I saw the thing. And right now, we're at a hundred and is that, that's our God. 
What is the pink diamond by my name? It means you're a VIP. I have you set as a VIP. Whoops, we are off course a little bit. I'll vote mobile so it doesn't tell me. Oh god. Hitch the nose up slightly. We're at, oh, we're not even at 84 yet, still. Yeah, I don't know where he went. <laughs> uh oh. New York Center causes one tree tree seven eight thousand three hundred feet. Oh god, what is going on with that? Causes one tree tree seven contact Philadelphia approach on one two tree decimal eight. Wow, that's actually really cool. This thing does a good job. Close by? Oh, you are? Let me see if I can in see you. So we're supposed to be at 83. So you can't just like go full speed. Yeah, above 110. I don't even know where my knots are at in this thing. I see TAS. I need to figure out how to get my aircraft on the 